This is a tutorial on how to fish in Rust. Fishing was only recently added to the game and you can actually do this by going to one of the two fishing villages. I recommend going to the large fishing village which you can find around the coast on your map. At the fishing village you'll be able to find this guy who will sell you some worms and you can also buy fishing rods. Alternatively you can also craft your own fishing rod. Now all this requires is two feet of rope and 200 wood to craft. So now you can equip your fishing rod and when you click it you will see you will have a section over here that contains. Now this is a part where you put bait. If you don't have bait you cannot fish. You need to put bait in. Now you can either use baits as in the form of worms which you can basically find from harvesting pumpkins, corn or even hemp plants or you can buy it from the guy we just bought the fishing rod from. Now it is important to note that there is a value on most items that can be used as bait and you will see here its effectiveness as a bait here for worms is three. All you have to do is just drag it on the fishing rod and you will see it is equipped in that contain section on the fishing rod. So when you have your bait equipped all you have to do is hold right click and this will put a bob marker. Now when it's red you cannot throw it you gotta wait for it to go blue. When it's blue you can throw it at that distance as basically as like you know from that far or that close and you basically now have to wait for a splashing effect so that the fish bites and when it does you left click now once you hear that sound you're gonna click left click and you're gonna hold it in to reel the fish in now you want to listen out for your line of your fishing rod because if it starts getting too tense it will snap and to relieve that tension you have to let go the dragging in button for a while and also use your A and D keys to kind of angle and pull the fish from one side to the other but if you do this too much you do risk the line snapping so you do have to release the pressure on the fish every now and again to keep pulling in it's almost like real life so like pull let go pull let go pull let go now while all you need is one worm you can start catching fish and once you actually catch fish you can use them as bait themselves you can see they have the same bait effectiveness as a normal worm but what you can do is also click the gut button which will actually gut the fish and you will get bones you will get like animal fat and you will get fish raw fish which you will see is actually better than your normal bait this one has a bait level effectiveness of five which is two points higher than the worms or the fish itself you can actually use raw pork and other animal meats as well which will also give you a decent and high enough bait level as well so basically any meats that you have in the game will work whether they're cooked or raw you can still use them as a bait now there are six special fish in the game that you're actually able to sell for scrap at the fishing village but they also act as something else you can see the bait level on these are really high this is the small trout this is the least worth fish in the game with the highest bait effectiveness at 10 because 10 is the highest effectiveness that you can get in the game currently now when you head back to the large fishing village you'll see there is a machine here that you can sell a bunch of fish, only six types. This is the small trout, the yellow perch, the salmon, catfish, orange ruffy, and the small sharks. In terms of the values here, you're going to get the least amount of money for the small trout and the yellow perches, and then the salmon is the fourth best, then catfish is the third, orange ruffy is the second best selling one, and then the small sharks is the one that's going to bring in the most money. So in terms of where you can fish, you can fish in any body of water anywhere, but there will be only certain fish that you can catch in certain locations. For example, you can't find a shark in a lake or any like small pool inland in one of the rivers. You'll only be able to get them out in the far sea areas. And obviously when you have baits of higher quality, you will catch better loot and better fish. If you don't really have a good bait, you're going to be catching low end quality, um, like, you know, items or fish stuff all the time. You just really have to master this like pull and push thing because that's the one thing that's going to really throw you off. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thank you so much for watching.